facing Memphis on the road last night. The last time the Green Wave beat the Tigers in Memphis, 1998. We'll pick this one up in the first quarter. Memphis driving until Tigers quarterback Seth Hennigan throws it. And Tulane's Lance Robinson comes up with the interception. Green Wave ball. Tulane makes the most of it. Michael Pratt hands off to Makai Hughes. Touchdown Green Wave 7-0. But Memphis would storm back right before halftime, 10-7 Tulane. Then Hennigan connects with Joseph Skates, who takes it in for the score. Memphis would take a 14-10 lead into the break. They would add to their lead right out of half. Hennigan finds Kobe Drake. Touchdown 21-10. Memphis with the lead. But Tulane responds. Pratt throws it a little high to Chris Carter. But a great catch there sets the green wave up at the one-yard line. So Pratt with the QB sneak to make it a 21 to 17 game. Memphis still with the lead. Fourth quarter we go. Pratt to Yol Keith Brown who takes it to the outside, sneaks into the corner of the end zone. Tulane takes the 24 to 21 lead and Tulane would hold on. Another touchdown from Lawrence Keys widens their lead. The Green Wave gets their first win in Memphis since 1998. 25 years. 31 to 21 was the final. Here's head coach Willie Fritz after the game. We just weren't finishing drives in the first half. You know, we were, I think we had 200 some odd yards, and, uh, but it was a lot of it was between the 20s, and, and uh, you know, I went for one that we didn't get. But uh, uh, you know, just got to keep. You know, it's, I told him at, at halftime. You know, it was 12 round fight. We fought six rounds. We had six rounds to go. You know, so you guys got to keep keep going, and, and the guys did it. And, and, you know, it's it's a good game to build off of, you know, as, as far, far as toughness is concerned. I thought they did a good job of that. 